Hello, today's devotional can be found in the guide to the scriptures under tempt or temptation. A test of a person's ability to choose good instead of evil. An enticement to sin and follow Satan instead of God. Nobody is immune from temptation. We face it every day and we will continue to face it as we go on in our lives. There will always be reasons to do that which is opposite of what Heavenly Father wishes us to do, but we don't have to pay attention to those reasons. In fact, we don't have to give in to temptation at all. We can ignore it and stay close to the Holy Spirit of God that we might be able to learn and grow according to our potential as children of God and use the opportunity that we have on this earth to do good and live well. Every time we are tempted it, it is an opportunity to become stronger in the gospel and hang on to God's spirit. We don't have to just think that we're going to be in great big trouble if we simply give up and allow ourselves to give in to temptation because temptation is just that it's a temptation it's not an action it's Satan's attempt to act upon us when we have the right to act for ourselves and we are given various abilities throughout our lives and we are taught the difference between good and evil, most of us. But at some point, we will have to test that knowledge that we have and our belief in it by choosing whether or not to believe in the side of good or in the side of evil. And we cannot be afraid to make that choice because if we don't make the choice, someone will try to act upon us. And then we are giving away our free agency. And our agency is meant to be ours. We cannot give it away simply because if we give it away, decisions will be made for us. And we need to make them for ourselves so that we can be in control of our destiny. Satan is so very powerful and things that we're irresponsible creatures who have no worth and are easy to act upon, let's prove him wrong by choosing properly and doing things that are good and will make us happy instead of doing things that are bad and that will invoke a sense of misery. But you know what? Everyone's got the right to choose for themselves. Of course, we are enticed to sin and cause hurt to others in the process and cause hurt to ourselves, but what's the point? Life isn't meant to be painful, life is meant to be enjoyful. But I guess that depends on our perspective and our belief in faith and hope. And with that said, I love you all so very much. And I say these things humbly in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen.